Greg Pallast, uh, author of Vulture's Picnic, is our guest. GregPallast.com. Let's jam in a few more phone calls. Brian in North Carolina, you're on the air. Go ahead. Uh, hey, Alex Stones and Greg Pallas. Hey. Uh, I was wondering, what do you think about the Agenda 21 plan, the UN takeover of the United States? Okay, I'll get Greg's take on that. Um, yeah, these multinational corporations, again, through left cover, getting global zoning passed so they can basically take property, eminent domain, stuff like that, Greg. Well, I don't know how much it has to do with the UN, but I can tell you the WTO documents uh, that I have, which they're confidential documents. And by the way, I, I presented them to the uh, to the Director General of the uh, WTO, Pascal Lamy. Uh, and, uh, one thing I a perk of working at BBC, I can actually get to these uh, to these critters, to these top guys. And yeah, uh, they've got a great program for imposing uh, an international set of laws that overwhelm any laws for protection of health, safety, and property uh, in any passed by any parliament or congress so that the these new WTO and financial services agreement it's at uh, the the, uh, the new elements of the GATS treaty general agreement on trade and services uh, these now are trumping trumping um, parliamentary and congressional votes in other words it's a, it's a it's a replacement for democracy uh, and that's what I'm very, very concerned about. But it, the main mechanism seems to be through the WTO and, of course, and the IMF and World Bank, which coordinates with it. Does that answer your question? I guess it does. The caller's gone. Let's go to Steve in Florida. Quick question from Steve. Steve, welcome. Hey, 